Right, so today we're going to be looking at um, bump testing a standard four gas de detector. So our standard four, as you can see by the graphic behind me, measures carbon dioxide, CO, oxygen, O2, H2S, hydrogen sulfide, and our lower explosive limits. First of all, we turn on our gas detector. It will go through a pre-start check. It goes through and ensures that all of the detecting devices are working. Once it's gone through that, it will do a fresh air calibration to ensure that it's stable and it is measuring the correct air. We have a look here, it actually tells us the upper and lower alarms, the peaks and the stells at what it is set for. It's going through testing and checking, test OK. We have two ways of doing a bump test. We can either do it back in the office using our bump test kits, stations, or we can do it remotely on site with a cap and gas bottle. The gas is calibrated and to do that we hold down, we'll actually do a calibration and bump test at once with this detector. We'll hold down the unit, it will turn off, go into calibration mode. Once it's done that we place the cap onto the device. It will ask me to apply the gas I'll turn the gas on and it will go through and do the calibration. I'll leave it sit there while it goes through and does that. So now the unit has come back calibrated and it tells me that by it says that the next calibration is due in 180 days. The bump test, which it was also performed at that point of time, applies a metered amount of gas across each sensor and ensures that each sensor is working correctly prior to entering the space.